um, hello YouTube. If you're upgrading from from um, Windows XP or Windows Vista, you need to know if your computer is compatible with Windows 7. So first, you wanna go to the Microsoft site for Windows 7. Once you're there, I want you to go to I want you to go to um, system requirements. So this will place the information what you need before installing Windows 7. So it needs one GB RAM or faster, 86 or 64 bit processor, one gigabyte RAM, and or two maybe. So you can read this additional features requirements needs to use before installing Windows 7. Uh, some of these are optional, uh, but you really need this. This four. So before you begin, you need to download Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor. Click on it. This will check your PC if you are if you are um if you if you want to know um about your drivers. And if your if your processor will do run faster and programs, devices, everything. So, so if you want to get it, scroll down, then download the Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor. Then it will take you to the Microsoft Download Center. Click on the download. And save it. Sorry about that. Okay, so once you have downloaded the uh, Windows 7 Upgrade Advisor, we will click on it, then run. And the Windows installer will install, then ac accept the license terms, and we wait while it installs itself into your system. So if you're running this site, you can probably run Windows 7. But you must at least have 1 gigabyte of RAM. So double click on the Windows 7 shortcut, upgrade advisor. for a while. Let's wait. Okay, here it is. Once you're there, um, check to see if your PC is ready for Windows 7. Uh, whatever. So, click on start. Check. So, this will take a few minutes and you will wait for it. So, Make sure that you can connect all of your devices so it will be included in the compatibility checking. Um, so I will do when it's done and I'll come back later. Alright, so it's done checking. So the I'm notifies me that. These features are no longer included in Windows 7. You may get similar programs in Windows 7 or other software. So, mail and parental controls or web filtering will not be in Windows 7. So, for my system requirements, pass. My error support, it can support my error. 1.5 8 gigahertz yeah, faster 1 GB RAM and I have more um, space on my D drive when the 7 requires 16 gigabyte bit so here we we'll see the devices that are compatible with Windows 7 so 
all of these are compatible uh, everything 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 and everything so you can download the device um the drivers are drivers for Windows 7 in the done um in, the, in my other tutorial I will make another tutorial if you want to download uh um compatible drivers for your Windows 7 if you're upgrading it so just wait for it so four programs listed as compatible Everything went fast, but not most of my programs. So let's go to the 64 bit report. And, and I'm not required, I'm not compatible with the 64 bits. So, of course, I'm using it on a 32 bit processor. So, if you're ready to install Windows 7, just click on just insert your disk, installation disk in order to install Windows 7. So thanks for watching and peace.